When we talk about footballing rivalries, we're talking about Collingwood and Carlton. For 125 years, the two clubs have been at each other's throats. In 253 meetings since the VFL began in 1897, the Blues are the only foundation team to hold a superior win-loss record against the Magpies. It's something we Collingwood types don't like to refer to too often, but the story of the two clubs goes beyond numbers. There have been brawls, controversies, huge comebacks and finals to savour, all played out in front of enormous crowds of parochial fans. In fact, the two clubs hold the record for the largest crowd in VFL, AFL history. 121,696 people crammed into the MCG for the 1970 Grand Final. And while we all know how that one turned out, it's a record that's safe in our keeping. A handful of players have spent time at both Victoria Park and Princess Park over the years. It's a group that includes some of the biggest names in football history. You may have heard of Peter McKenna and Dale Thomas. Chances are you also know of Mick Mugwan. Fortunately, his stay as a Blue was brief, and we Magpies prefer to remember him for moments like this, when he parted the Blue Sea to kick a seven-bounce goal in 1994. Mugwan's had five bounces, nearly get another one. Round he goes, in he goes to an open goal. Phil Manassa, stopped by Mickey Mugwan. Great Peter Dacos loved to turn it on against the Blue Baggers too. The big crowds played into his hands, no more so than when he launched this torpedo from beyond the 50 arc at Waverley in 1990. Look at that. In modern times, Collingwood has had the better of Carlton. In the new millennium, the Magpies have won 22 of the 34 meetings between the two clubs. Will this form line hold true in 2017? Only one thing is certain. It never matters where the two clubs are on the ladder. They always put on a good show.